What is up guys, it's the Not Safe Word Gamer back with another part of Let's Find Out How I Feel About Minecraft 1.10, the new update for Minecraft. Um, so I'm not going to lie to you, I did a bunch of stuff off screen because I just I found it all tedious and boring, I pretty much was just mining. So I got some redstone, some gold, some iron, I built some more uh, furnaces, it was just, it was nothing special. I, I, yeah, I just did it all to save some time, energy, and effort. So now we have a decent amount of resources. I'm going to go ahead and build ourselves some armor here. So we can have all that good stuff. And actually, maybe our first, first new thing for the update. Uh, the the shield or what the hell ever it is, however you build that. I I actually don't have any idea how you build that, so I'm gonna look it up on my phone, and I shall uh, be right uh, back. So I figured out how to make the shield, looked it up on my phone and stuff, and uh, tried to memorize the recipe. I think it's boom 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 boom. There it is. Yes. Um, what is weird is I thought that this, you could have different tiers of this, so I could have like a diamond shield, but from the quick googling I did, I guess not, which I'm surprisingly okay with, because I don't need one anyways. But yes, as I said, our goal for this is to get to the end and kill the ender dragon, actually. And the diamonds I got, the five diamonds I got are actually making us well on our way to doing that. Um, which is weird, because I thought that this would last a lot longer than it is. Or at least I wouldn't have reached my objective so quickly. Or I wouldn't have made so much headroom on my objective as it did. But um, I am, so let's uh, keep going. Now we're going to go down into the mines and make some obsidian so we can make a nether portal so we can go into the nether and find a fortress so we can get nether wart so we can make potions now normally when i was playing minecraft unmodded i didn't make potions from my life because i didn't see a point to them it was all very a lot of waiting and, and a lot of memorizing recipes and i didn't like that but uh now um since i'm trying to race But now since we're trying to uh, race to the Ender Dragon, um, we're going to be taking on some, I'm sorry, I, I turned the, the volume down now. and uh, I saw that you could do something, this, thank you, um, yes, but now since I'm trying to race to the end, I feel like potions will really help me out, and they most definitely won't hurt. So I am going to spend some quality time messing with that and see all we can do here. Alright, uh, yeah, so I, I've been having a lot of trouble with my recording software lately, mostly because I, I do it for, use it for a lot of different things, and especially when I had my migraine, I just used OBS. Usually I use OBS and Audacity to record, so I use OBS for my visuals and the the sound from the game I'm playing, and I use Audacity for my microphone volume. Uh, I don't know why, it just works out better for me that way, so that's what I do. But, oh, fuck me. Um, yeah, okay, let's see what's going Um, but, I turn on the microphone portion of OBS to record in all. Uh, to record that migraine video and I ended up keeping it on for this video and the Halloween special so like three videos I had it on and I kind of didn't even remember so I've been trying to deal with that for however long you've seen this going on and it's it's really it was frustrating but so I just kind of have to fix it and make sure I remember to that's exactly what I didn't want to happen. Anyways, there, yeah, I just need to fix it and make sure that 
all the settings are correct before I start recording, which I have trouble with because I uh, I procrastinate recording and I put it off to like the very last minute. Well, that's pretty much how I do everything, and I really need to stop, especially since my computer is literally so crappy that a 15-minute video takes 45 minutes to render, especially with all the edits and cuts and fun stuff I try to do in my videos and usually don't succeed. It takes forever. Like that one video where I fast-forwarded through the mining took over an hour to render, which is super irritating because... I record like that's why all my video if you notice all my videos have been pushed off by a day which I'm trying to get back on track with today because what was I going to say hey hey brain come back brain come back brain come back brain come back brain brain oh fuck it's gone um because all my videos were pushed off a day yes because rendering and editing took longer than I thought so, I'm trying to get that back on track today with a very lightly edited video and I'm recording way earlier in the night, which I actually should be recording earlier in the day. It's really funny if you look at my... Okay, if you look at my calendar, so, which I started using recently because I want to get more organized, it says record from 3 to 7 for the first video and then 7 to 11 for the second video. Record and edit. That's that's not how it goes. Usually, I uh, I uh, procrastinate for literally that entire time. Like like quite literally the entire time possible. So, and then I end up recording at eleven, and then trying to record, edit, and render and upload all of it in like two femtoseconds. So that is is a problem. But I'm trying to get back on track, trying to figure out what the fuck I'm doing with my life. Also, um, if you notice, there haven't there hasn't been a second video lately for a multitude of reasons. Um, one was because of the Halloween special. I it may not have looked like it, but I did put a lot of effort into that, and that took up a couple days. And then I had the migraine for one of the days. Today, I've just kind of realized that second video is kind of just more of like a treat it's not really helping my channel out any not I haven't noticed a gain in views or subscribers or anything and it's really the trying to the stress of trying to put two videos out a day was really starting to wear on me so I ended up just so I think I'm gonna end up just like posting a second video whenever I feel like it and maybe sometimes it will be a second super edited video and sometimes it won't. Uh, something, maybe it will be just like normal uh, Black Ops gameplay. I don't know, it's gonna, it's gonna really depend on just how I'm feeling. But, 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 but. I'm gonna tangent off and then come back to what I was just thinking. Uh, tangent. I forgot what the tangent was supposed to say. Uh, oh well. Anyways, I was going to say that uh, I'm having a friend help me out with some stuff and things and stuff, so I should definitely... Oh, yes, I remember what I was going to say. Um, so I, I guess these Minecraft videos are now going to be like little update videos where I talk about stuff and life and th basically whatever I want is I think what I'm going for here. This is really... And if I find something interesting about the game, I'll talk about that, but it will just be me kind of just rambling and talking off the cuff and all that fun stuff. Anyways, yes, so I have a, a friend who's going to be helping me out with the uh, video editing, which will probably re result in two highly edited videos a day if he does one and I do one. Um, granted, I have to record both of them, but it will be, the videos will be better edited, there will be two of them, and... Also, I'm getting a new GPU, so the gameplay will be better, the rendering will be faster. Just pretty much everything is going to be looking up, hopefully shortly. Fingers crossed. Fingers massively, massively crossed. I'm skeptical, but I don't know. This this sounds like there's promise. Um, so that's that's been going on and stuff. Uh... 
the Halloween special. I don't. You guys have to tell me how you like the Halloween special. I tried a couple of new things that I haven't really done before. Um, I, I did try to play a nice little Halloween prank on you guys with the jump scare and the. Well, I won't tell you when, just in case for those who haven't seen it. But yeah, I, I tried to play a nice little Halloween prank. I didn't need 30 of these. I don't know why. I guess I can make an enchanting table. I was just kind of mining. Anyways, yeah, so I guess I can make a nice little, uh, yeah. So let me know how you guys like the Halloween special down in the dis the comment section down below. Tell me what you thought of it and things. Um, I was kind I, 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 I thought it was really positive, and the one person I who, like, watches my videos religiously told me they really enjoyed it. So, I think it came out well for what I was going for. Um hope it was super entertaining again i super hate that format but if you guys like it i'll get accustomed to it i guess so i'll do it more often but i, I thought it was fun and entertaining and i definitely will be doing more specials in the future because i don't know i just i like i like the idea of specials they're they're fun they're lighthearted. they're usually one-off no, oh, it's it's interesting to me. So, but if I do do one for the next holiday coming up would be Thanksgiving, and after that Christmas, the holiday, the special I'd be doing for Thanksgiving, I definitely want to put more time and effort into it. So I want to put um, I want to put, <laughs> which is weird because I put a lot into this. But I'll, instead of spending like two days on it, I want to spend like five days on it and maybe have some skits thrown in there instead of just game playing. Um. If you look at uh, what Jacksepticeye did on his channel for this Halloween, it was really interesting what he did with the whole antiseptic angle of it. I found that intriguing. No, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do anywhere near that. I want to, of course, do my own thing. But I love the idea of putting extra time and effort, um, em effort and emphasis and editing and like storyline and plot into just like an, a, the idea of like a one-off thing that like. Just like a one-off special. Which, um... The idea of calling them specials actually came from Nerd Cute, But he does his specials for, like... Subscriber milestones. Which, I... Of course, I'll do specials then, too. But... I don't see myself reaching a subscriber milestone anytime in the near future. Or, well, a milestone I would like. So, like, a thousand... Or 10,000 or 100 subscribers even. I don't see me reaching that anytime in the future. So I, I'm i going to try to find every excuse I can to make a special. I.e. Uh, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Probably for laughs I'll do a Jewish special. Where I'll release a, like, <laughs> a little video every day of um, Hanukkah. So like instead of... So, like, instead of one really great video, or really seven mediocre videos, like, instead of how you get one really great day of gifts, you get seven days of, uh, mediocre crappy gifts. And, uh, I mean, no offense to any Jewish people, except for all the offense possible. I'm just kidding. And if it wasn't for you, who would do my accounting? They me, I guess. I, I would do my accounting, because I do my accounting now. But, I mean, if I actually had money to account... Who would do it? Say, wonderful. Thing. I don't think I don't think Hitler really thought that one through, did he? Just killing off all the Jews. Who would do his taxes or be his doctor or I guess he'd be Asian, but he ain't like them either. So, and I now realize how racist the last minute and a half have been, and I'm gonna leave it in there. I'm gonna I'm I'm, I'm gonna let it go because I told you guys I'd probably offend all of you in this, and then, uh, I'm a man of my word. But it, it, all my jokes are meant in good fun. There's no offense meant behind the jokes, they're just meant to be jokes for ha-has and laughs. Like a comedian. Which actually, speaking of which, uh, there was a comedian talking about how he's... I don't remember which comedian it was, but they said that they were, like, getting tired of just, like, being a comedian because back in the day they used to tell a joke and it could be, like, super racy and terrible and, like, people would understand that they're just jokes 
and so they would people would just laugh or not laugh and move on with their lives but nowadays today if a comedian makes a joke and it's not that great uh, they get like sued and their life gets destroyed and they get called a racist and they have to apologize now don't get me wrong I, I think that there are a lot of things uh, in this world that are not right but I think the idea of jokes are just that jokes they're meant to entertain and make light out of a situation and that is how some people cope with bad situations and I mean there are also people who go into their room and blast heavy metal music I feel like it's no more right to say one person's way of coping with a situation is better than another's now granted some people make money off of telling jokes but that's the same way some people make money off of sad death metal music I feel like it's the same thing and it's the same reason why I feel like the people who are, are uh, I'm gonna draw a line in the sand here but I feel like people who are pro-gun and want to have gun I feel like you can't you don't have the ability to tell other people what they can or cannot or should or should not do even though that that's something they enjoy. Like, uh, most, not most, but there are some, probably, maybe a small group, I don't know, but I definitely know that they exist. Racist, misogynistic, homophobic individuals who love their guns and think that they have, that their guns are the be-all, end-all of existence, but someone trying to be happy with someone of the same sex is wrong. It's it's kind of it's kind of two faced. You can't expect people to be okay with what you like, but then not be okay with what other people like. Because it's no different than what you. It, it, it's different from what you like, but it's different from what you like. But it, it's, it's it's still not your place. If you, if you don't like it or enjoy it, then don't do it. It's that simple. I don't like or enjoy heroin, so I don't do heroin. I don't think it should be illegal to do heroin. I mean, if one person is doing heroin by themselves in a closet, I don't see what the harm is to anyone else, and I don't see how it's really anyone else's business. Now, I think it's wrong for you to do heroin and then take care of a small child because you don't have the mental capacity to do that. But, again, I, if you have no responsibilities and you aren't stealing or hurting anybody, go do heroin, I guess. I don't care. It's what you like to do, and I hope that me extending the courtesy of telling you that I'm okay with what you like to do, you would extend the same courtesy in telling me that it's okay for me to do what I like to do. And I think that's a basic rule that should apply to anything, not only controversial topics, but topics like the people in the world who go, oh, why are you watching a guy play video games? Um, well, why are you watching a guy play a sport instead of going out and playing the sport? It's the same thing, it's just, you can't tell can't question what other people enjoy because you don't enjoy it yourself. You have no right to see what plays. Because there are things that you enjoy that other people would be flabbergasted that you enjoy. But those people understand what it's like to be ridiculed for what they enjoy, so they keep it to themselves. You need to find a food source. There's pumpkins, but you can't eat pumpkins, right? Well, at least I don't think you can eat pumpkins. You can eat cake. I don't remember how you make cake. It's like flour, eggs, and something else. Um, yeah. How do you... I think this was for the Halloween update. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah, I don't know if you can eat these. I don't think so. She can make seeds. I don't know what you can do with those either. I guess grow pumpkins, but then what do you do with the pumpkins? It's... yeah. I, I've really forgotten a lot about this game. Because I feel like there's pumpkin pie, but I don't remember how you make pumpkin pie. So, I'm just gonna kill some sheep. And then cook their flesh. 
I wonder who the first person to do that was killing an animal and eat it. And how they propose that to other people. This is like the first person to have sex. How did you bring that up to someone else? Or did you bring that up to someone else? That's an intriguing question. The first person to have sex, did, did they tell people? Or did everyone just kind of learn to have sex by themselves? And like the first person to have sex, they kind of just like stumble upon it? Like they were just like walking down the street one day and tripped and fell into a girl. Went, oh, hey, this is a thing we can do that's fun. Also kind of raises the question of what happened for the first birth when a woman like grew like... I don't know how much weight do women put on in pregnancy? 20? 30 pounds? I don't know. When women put on, when a woman put on a lot of weight for 9 months and then a baby popped out. Why didn't men revere women as magicians who needed to be praised as gods? I mean, they kind of made life. That's an intriguing question. It's really weird to think about what people were like before they uh, got uh, intel uh, not really intelligent because technically we were intelligent life before that, but before we uh, were more well informed about what was in our universe and what things were like. Huh. Anyways, um, we're going to make some cooked mutton here. And because I am running on to the end of this episode, the next episode we will be jumping into the nether to try to chase down some stuff. So, uh, yeah. Actually, oh, let's jump into the nether now. Hope some good stuff happens. Actually, I gotta make a, a iron sword first. Yeah, I'm probably not gonna go to the nether. Yeah, yeah, no. No. They're gonna save that for next episode. I was going to, and I thought about it. No, we're saving that for next episode. Alright. Uh next episode, we venture into the nether. Uh I love you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, press the like button down below. Tell me what you thought of the Halloween special in the comments. Tell me what you thought of this video in the comments. Um, tell me what you think life was like before we really understood anything. I think it'd be quite intriguing. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video, whenever that happens to be, probably, tomorrow. But you guys can hope for later today, I guess. I love you guys. I really, really do. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.